grocery haul, a keto quarantine grocery haul. And I was a little bit indifferent about doing one because I know there might be people around the world that's less fortunate or can't find the things that I'm able to find. But I wanted to just come and kind of give everybody like a little bit of normalcy since, you know, I do these on my channel and I kind of just wanted to put a video out there that's not a, related to the CV, okay? So yeah, guys, go ahead, hit subscribe, hit the bell, fight me and let's get it cracking. Um, I'm gonna try to vlog, but y'all already know, I don't know how it's gonna be up in there. But I'm going to try to vlog. So, um, yeah, if I don't vlog while I'm in Walmart, then I'll see you guys when we get back to the house. But I wanted to come invite y'all to the gang. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Okay, guys, I have made it home. And, y'all, when I say I bought so much stuff, I bought so much stuff, it's ridiculous. But, y'all, I really haven't been grocery shopping in about three weeks. Y'all know I popped in Aldi real quick, um, like, two weeks ago, and that's been it. So, I stocked up because I haven't been grocery shopping. But, I do want to let you guys know, and I know everybody has said it, but the stores will restock. So, we don't have to go crazy. We don't have to, like, really, like, kill each other to get this stuff. So, just love each other. Leave some stuff for everybody else. And let me turn the camera around and get into it because I know it's going to take me a minute because I got so much freaking stuff so let's get into it i'm gonna kind of roll kind of quick because i really don't want this grocery haul to be that long um so yeah i tried to group everything together but it may be kind of all over the place oh and another thing everything is not keto hold on let me turn the camera around yes y'all everything is not keto if i'm gonna die in a zombie apocalypse I want to die with carbs in my body. So everything is not keto. I did stick closely and mostly to keto, but I did grab a couple things that I might want to enjoy or that, you know, I might just want throughout this quarantine. Like I said, this is my first time leaving the house in three days. So I'm really trying to stick and stay in the house and do what the governor and the mayor says. So yeah, everything is not keto. Keto police, everything is not keto. Okay, let's get into the haul. It's hard out here. So yeah, first I got four tomatoes and these tomatoes can be made, um, can be used for salads, sandwiches, whatever. So I got four tomatoes and then I got a head of lettuce. I got this Caesar grilled chicken chopped kit. So it has romaine lettuce, cheese, croutons, Parmesan cheese, and white chicken meat. Of course, I would not eat the croutons. Um, I got two bags of iceberg lettuce. Y'all know I love salads with tuna on top, but I forgot tuna. But I did get some other meat. So I got two bags of iceberg lettuce. And then I got some blue plate mayo. If y'all know about blue plate, <laughs> leave a comment down below. But um, yeah, so I got some blue plate mayo. So that's um, the next thing I got. And yeah, I'm not gonna like break it up in portions. I'm just gonna keep rolling. So the next thing that I got was this Torani classic hazelnut. I thought I had got the Starbucks brand, but um, I don't think it was sugar-free. So yeah, this is for my coffee and everything. So I got the classic hazelnut sugar-free. And then I also got my favorite, the sugar-free vanilla Starbucks brand from Walmart. And of course it has, um, well, it has one carb per 
one tablespoon and then obviously the classic vanilla has i mean the classic hazelnut has zero so yeah i got those sweeteners from my coffee y'all already know i got a couple of my favorite drinks so i got the clear american two black cherry a peach a cherry limeade and a fuji apple so yeah those are the drinks that i got um i also got this iced coffee blind roast. Y'all know I love this. Unsweetened. And it has two carbs per 12 fluid ounces or whatever. So, yeah. That's the coffee I'm rocking with. Um, I also grabbed some heavy whipping cream. Y'all know I need this. So, yeah. I can't wait till the morning because I'm going to make me a bombing, a bombing, a bomb um, cup of iced coffee. So, yeah. That's all the drinks I got. Moving on. I got this holy guacamole. Um to eat with like pork rinds and stuff like that and i got it in the mild flavor because y'all know i don't like spicy stuff i got this deli fresh uh rotisserie seasoned chicken breast and i got the family size because again i plan on eating like sandwiches and like putting this meat on salads and um i can also use this meat in the low carb tortillas and make kind of like a little sandwich or whatever so i did get that um i picked up these turkey bites and it's protein filled and again they have one carb so yeah i got these turkey bites from walmart everything's from walmart i got this sargento cheese i got the four cheese mexican blend y'all know i usually get walmart brand but this is the only brand they had so yeah i got this cheese um, for fruit, I did grab some blackberries. I grabbed some strawberries. Y'all know blackberries, blueberries, strawberries are all keto friendly. But I also splurged and I got this pineapple blend. And it just got pineapples, mangoes, and grapes. So yeah, I got this in case I just wanted something a little extra sweet or if I had extra carbs to spare. So yeah, now we're going to move on to like the frozen stuff and the meat. So y'all know I love Green Giant stuff. So I got the Green Giant rice cauliflower. Y'all already know the carbs are less to none. So yeah, I got the Green Giant rice cauliflower. I also got the Green Giant veggie um, spirals, the zucchini spirals. And this is if I want to do like um, spaghetti one night. I can use these noodles and I can use hamburger meat and sauce and i can do like a healthy healthier version of spaghetti so i got those um i got these oven roasters and remember i tried these before and they are bomb so i got the broccoli and cauliflower one i also picked up this new bag of grilled veggies and it's zucchini so i was thinking i can use these for like um a, a healthy keto friendly lasagna so i could probably like lay these down and then put meat and cheese and sauce and bake it so yeah i'm gonna try to do a healthy lasagna with this grilled zucchini so yeah um let's move on so y'all y'all know i hate these but i picked them up again because i'm gonna try them one more time in my air fryer and it's so funny because my mom called me and was like should i get real good and i was like no but i'm gonna try them again in my air fryer so i picked these up and y'all know four carbs per serving um i also picked up this happy food chicken alfredo bowl and it is carb wise and it is tender diced chicken riced broccoli cauliflower florets spinach onions and mozzarella cheese and a delicious alfredo sauce so i've never had this before this bowl has seven carbs but it's okay this kind of reminds me of the atkins meal so yeah i'm excited to try this this may be my lunch tomorrow um for breakfast i decided to try these jimmy dean delight egg witches and it's broccoli and cheese egg frittatas with chicken sausage and cheese um they have 14 grams of protein they must be pretty big sandwiches because this is a big box to only have four and they have eight carbs one dietary fiber so yeah what one sandwich and seven cars but again this is a huge box so i'm thinking they're pretty big so this could be like a breakfast or brunch um kind of option um i also picked up this sheet pan meal y'all know i love a good sheet pan meal and it has um smoked sausage with vegetables and it has um sausage green peppers onions and potatoes and i'm just now noticing it has potatoes but that's okay i would still probably enjoy it um and just eat around the potatoes i would definitely eat around the potatoes or i may eat a couple of them it just depends um so yeah i did get this or i might take the potatoes out and then add broccoli that's probably what i would do because i love broccoli 
Um, I picked up another bag of meatballs. So yeah, if I wanted to do spaghetti with those zucchini noodles, I could just um, add the meatballs and the meat sauce or whatever I wanted. So I got a bag of those. And then I also got these kicking barbecue red hot wings. Y'all, I think it's like 10 carbs per five. Yeah, so it's 10 carbs per five, which is not very keto friendly. But again, like I said, everything I got is not keto friendly this time. And I wanna try out my air fryer. So I'll definitely try these one day. Y'all, I got three packs of meat. So I got some lean ground beef. I got some ground beef sirloin. And then I got some beef steak burgers. So yeah, all they really had in my store was like beef. So I just kind of stocked up on beef um, because that's all they had. Um, I did get some salt and vinegar pork rinds because these are my favorite flavor pork rinds. I got these Ritz toasted chips with sour cream and onion, which are not keto, but I did pick these up if I wanted some. And then lastly, I did get some bread, which is not keto. Again, like I said, everything in my haul is not keto just because, um, it's just not keto. I didn't get everything keto. So yeah, this is kind of like an overview of everything that I got. Y'all, I went ham turkey, literally ham turkey. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog. If you made it all the way to the end of the vlog, then go ahead and drop, um, hopefully it's a grocery cart or something like that. Whatever you see on the screen, drop it down below. I love y'all and I'll see you guys in my next video, which hopefully will be tomorrow, Friday. Um, yeah, so leave the grocery cart or whatever it is you see on the screen down below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Reporting live from the internet, signing out back to you world. Deuces.